What's up, y'all? It's Mr. Six Foot Eight in the house. Back at you with a new video. Finally, okay? Look, I done seen here and came across this new product review, okay? And this is what this is going to give. It's called Coca-Cola Dream World Limited Edition. You see there? And then honor, you know, I even got the red. See the red like the Coke? Ooh, okay, that was corny. Keep going. <laughs> So, apparently, Coca-Cola, as of August the 15th, which is, I guess, like a month ago or over a month, this hit shelves, released a limited edition of a Dream World flavored Coca-Cola, which, according to CNET, tastes like Skittles. Now, according also to the CNET article, this was released, um, it says, to replicate or be similar to tasting like what, I guess, Coke bite or Coke Bites tried to replicate the taste of Pixels and Coke Starlight sought to remind drinkers of space. Okay, I don't know what all that means. Keep going. But it says, Coke Lunch Coca-Cola creations in February as a platform for a series of limited editions flavors featuring unique innovations and unexpected collaborations. Coca-Cola said that Coke Dream World bottles up the technicolor taste and surrealism of the subconscious Dream World will be the fourth and last Coca-Cola Creations flavor released in 2022. Now, I'm going to go ahead and sit here and tell you right now, I'm not a big Coke person, okay? Now, I do like a Coke every now and then when I need to stay awake or when I want to sit here and feel a hole in my chest or feel like that my chest is going to cave in. I'm going to sit here and drink a Coke every now and then. But other than that, I don't really see him too much care for Coke, but I'm not, I'm not saying I don't like it. I'm just saying I don't drink it as often as I drink ginger ale. Hint, <laughs> hint. But I do like me a strong Coke every now and then. However, I have, if I was to sit here and actually say I like Coke, I would say that I like either a Diet Coke, Coke Zero, or either a vanilla Coke. Don't ask me why. I'm just weird like that. I don't like a lot of sweet drinks, like overly sweet drinks. I don't want these drinks to taste, I don't want the drinks to taste like syrup. You feel me? Okay, so this right here is a dream flavor Coke. Let me uh, explain to you or show you what it has in it. It says total fat grams, zero grams, sodium, 50 milligrams, total carbs, 65 grams, total sugars, 65 grams, including 65 grams of added sugar, daily value, 129%, protein, zero G. Not a significant source of saturated fat, trans fat, cholesterol, fiber, vitamin D, calcium, iron, and potassium. Okay, whatever. So, oh, here we go. Let's try it. Now, look, before I sit here and turn this up, I don't know if you all have ever experienced any of this, but... For the last couple of times that I've seen here and bought a Coke from a gas station, this one did not come from a gas station. Luckily, my Coke has smelled like the bottom of somebody's shoe in a gym locker room. Or better yet, it smelled like mildew. I don't know if that's some kind of issue with the bottle or what. So now I have, I have to always smell my bottles. Even though this came from Kroger's, this did not come from a gas station. But I'm just saying. Okay, keep going. Open your mouth. Okay, okay, it's pretty good. It's pretty. Damn. Okay, this is pretty good. Yeah, it does taste like it's got Skittles in it. It definitely tastes like it. Hold on. Chest is caved in. Okay, hold on. Yeah, I just had to make sure. Okay, so it definitely tastes like it's got Skittles in it, for sure. It tastes just like you see that rainbow back there. This right here, okay, Cole, we're going to give you, I would say, maybe an A+. Plus. Mm, yeah, no, we're going to give you like an A. It's not as good as the original Coke, 
even though I'm not a fan of the original original Coke because I take a Coke Zero or a Diet Coke because of it being less sweet. But I like this better than vanilla Coke, if that's to be fair. Hold on. I also let my mom taste it, which is why some was missing from the bottle. Okay, I let her pour some, okay, because you know I don't believe in drinking behind folks in our family. And if some of y'all drink behind folks, you're nasty. Shame on you. But this is good. This is good. I can rock with this. This is Coke flavored. Okay, you see it once again, Dream World. You can find it at Kroger, I know for sure. It's two oh nine a bottle before tax in Georgia, I know for sure. Okay, um, I'm quite sure you can find this at your local gas station probably for a limited time. And it represents the rainbow, or, it, or at least I feel like a rainbow when I taste it. Dream a little dream of me. But it's pretty good. Okay, it's pretty good. It's not bad. It's not as bad as I would have expected it to be. And I had actually bought the other Coke, which was called Coke Starlight, but I never did get a chance to taste it because it did not look appealing to me. And neither did this look appealing, but I decided to give this a try. And I actually like this, okay? Would I buy it again? I would definitely say Mr. Six Foot Eight would buy this again. <laughs> It definitely reminds me once again, it tastes like it has, it tastes like they infused it with literally Starburst or Skittles. That's what I'm reminded of. Like you can still taste the crispness of the Coke in there because I've been letting it sit in the refrigerator for a while, but it definitely tastes like it has Skittles and Starburst infused in it. Now the ingredients I don't think says that because the ingredients say carbonated water, high fructose corn syrup, uh, caramel color, natural flavors, for sorbic phosphoric acid. Boy, y'all know I'm country. Keep going. And caffeine, okay? But this is something that... Damn. This is something I would definitely buy again, okay? It's not bad. And most of all, because I just brushed my teeth, it doesn't leave your mouth uh, like a bluish weird color. Like you don't have all of that dye in it. I mean, I know it's got the, I guess, the dye from the Coke, I guess, or whatever makes it dark, but at least your tongue is not all weird looking and you can still work throughout the day without looking like that you just been at the Olympics at your uh, playground on the school field, okay, or recess all day eating doggone Starburst or some other kind of weird candy. So this... Definitely gets Mr. Six Foot Eight approved, okay? The approved seal of Mr. Six Foot Eight, I would give this an A, okay? The only reason why I would not give it an A plus is once again, I'm not a huge fan of Coke. I feel like if they could have did something different, I mean, is it something that you would say is spectacular or just absolutely special that you're just going to be like, wow, I'm going to come back to this? No, it just literally tastes like that they made Coke and put bubble gum now laters and skittles in it and just said this is what we're gonna sit here and sell and call it a limited edition so that's why i give it an a and not an a plus so let me know what you sit here and think but i do sit here and give it the seal of approval for mr six foot eight okay try it out leave it in the comments tell me what you think and until next time i ain't gonna tell you nothing wrong i'm just gonna sit here and tell you what i know and what i feel okay and if you don't like it that's your problem okay ain't got nothing to do with me until now until later bye